Welcome to Bucks on the Pond, powered by Ford. This is the game show where you can win some bucks at the ballpark. I'm your host, JB, in our MLB.com HQ in New York. Today, our technology takes us all the way to the West Coast in Chavez Ravine. Some Dodgers fans will see if they can bank some bucks. Let's meet them, see how they do. All right, what are your names? Where are you four from? Danica from Temecula. I'm Joey from Temecula. Megan from Menifee. Jason from Menifee. And how do you four Dodgers fans all know each other? What's the bond? Uh, all drinking buddies. Yeah. Absolutely. All right, that's a good bond. And are you all Dodgers fans? Yes, absolutely. And are you guys ready to play some bucks on the pond? Yeah! yeah. I'll ask you a trivia question on each pitch of this half inning of Dodgers baseball. Correct answer banks you some bucks. An incorrect answer is a strike. Make it through the half inning without striking out. The bucks in your bank are yours to keep. And thanks to our good friends at Ford, they'll match every buck you win with a donation to the Wounded Warrior Project. So your win really does go further. Huff is on the hill, Gordon is at the dish. On the pitch, your first question worth five bucks. Who led the Dodgers in saves in 2013? Kenley Jansen. The big man with the big arm is worth five bucks. <laughs> what is the hole on top of a whale's head called? Blowhole. The blowhole is what it's called. <laughs> that is now 10 solid bucks in your bank. Who did Beyonce Knowles marry on April 4th, 2008? Gordon will ground out for out number one. So who married Beyonce in 08? Yeah. Jay-Z. Jay-Z! Jay you four now have 15 bucks in your bank with one out on the Dodgers. Correct answers will be worth 10 bucks each. As Crawford settles in, your first 10 buck question is, who threw the most recent no-hitter in Dodgers history? Crawford hits that one. Pagan will track it down for out number two on the Dodgers. Most recent no-hitter was pitched by whom? No, no, no. no in Dodgers history. Clayton Kershaw. He was the most recent, the big ace for the Dodgers. That quick two outs on the Dodgers now means each answer for you that is correct is worth 20 bucks. The questions will be a little bit tougher, but I think you four are a pretty good team. With zero strikes, you're in great shape. Ramirez is your first 20 buck batter. Kublai Khan was the grandson of what former ruler of Mongolia? Uh, Siri. No. <laughs> Siri is not a lifeline. Is that what's in my hole? Uh, Genghis Khan. Out of nowhere, Genghis Khan, huh? Well, yeah, Genghis Khan is right. <laughs> Who plays the con man Santa in the 2003 film, Bad Santa? Con man Santa. Billy Bob Thornton. Billy Bob Thornton is correct. Woo! Nicely done. <laughs> yeah, you got a perfecto going, in fact. You guys are in great shape. With 20 more of those bucks, what is the capital of Texas? Austin. Oh, he didn't even, he didn't even think. Nope. He didn't need to. It's Austin. Yeah! What is the name of Prince's original backup band? Oh, come on, dude, you're the music guru. So close. Because we used to make that drink called Pollution, and it was purple, and it was just silly. Prince and the Revolution? Prince and the Revolution is absolutely right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, I can't believe you knew that. <laughs> That's right, that conviction has earned you 105 bucks so far, which means it's time for Say the Word, powered by Ford Sync. You can risk up to 105 of those bucks on the next question. If you're right, you win that amount. If you're wrong, you will lose that amount. And for you, it would be the first strike. So, how much do you want to risk? Ten bucks. Ten bucks. Ten bucks. Thank you, may I have another? Of all of it. Just ten bucks. Okay. The Perfecto crew of fans is going to risk ten bucks. For ten more bucks, Big Hurt, what do you got? When a hitter breaks his bat while getting a single, it is known as a Blank bat single. It's a six letter word. Say the word. Broken bat single. That is the type of single we were looking for. <laughs> and you do add 10 full bucks to your total. Yeah, hey, right, ten, a buck is a buck. <laughs> that is excellent economics, sir. Two Dodgers hit 20 or more home runs in 2013 as Ramirez. Hits one himself. So that was a 20 buck question. It's now worth 90. Two Dodgers hit 20 or more home runs in 2013. Name one of them. Okay, all right. We're going with Adrian Gonzalez. You go with Adrian Gonzalez because he was one of the two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
As a matter of fact, Hanley was the other power bat. So that adds 90 bucks to your bank. You now have 205 bucks, no strikes. You guys are in great shape. Gonzalez is now actually batting. Besides being an archaeologist, what was the day job of the title character in the Indiana Jones films? No. Uh, he was a college professor. Teaching about the adventures of archaeology. That's exactly right. And wearing awesome hats. Which news anchor was famous for the phrase, and that's the way it is. Gonzalez rolls over on that one, and that will be out number three for the Dodgers. They are done, which means you are all winners. You had 20 bucks. Who said? And that's the way it is. <laughs> I would go with the famous news guy who's like the real one. Walter Cronkite, from out of nowhere, that's the perfecto. I saw his face. Yeah. Are you serious? We really got that yes, right. Yes, you really yes, got that right. 245 bucks right, in fact. Yeah. <laughs> Those four just earned 245 bucks during their day at the park, and thanks to our friends at Ford, that also means another 245 bucks will be donated to the Wounded Warrior Project. I want to thank you for being with us for this episode of Bucks on the Pond, powered by Ford. I am JB. Keep visiting MLB.com slash Bucks. And who knows? Maybe next time we'll catch you at the ballpark. We want some Bucks with Bucks on the Pond! Woo!